The candidate buzz with, of course, KUM analyst, political analyst, Dr. Ron McNitz. Doc, polling. Everybody's doing polling. Sure. How can we, I mean, of course, every poll has plus or minus. Sure. You conduct your poll in, in a different method. Sure. Talk to us about polling methods sure. and, and the accuracies of, of, these, met, of, of these pollings. Okay. Uh, first, there's something I'd like the public to know. It's pretty basic. Online pollings are for fun. There, at least right now, most online polls that I've seen, and then there are several versions, are basically open-ended. Uh, you you go ahead and participate. You get your friends to participate, and they leave them open for a very long time. While they're kind of sort of fun, that's about it. Mm -hmm. uh, a, a legitimate poll usually will have several key characteristics, and we do. Uh, and by the way, I'm not saying the other polls are not legitimate. I'm just saying they're for fun. Mm -hmm. And if you're using them for recreation or whatever, that's great. But a, a poll that's kind of conducted in a normal way, one that you can count on, has several important characteristics. Uh, first, there's a sample. And that is a sample that's done in a, in a way to pick the people to participate in a way that reflects the community, in a way that reflects a, a good method. Of, of selecting people. The second thing is you've got to ask them the right questions in the right sorts of ways and then you have to uh, be fair and objective in how you design the poll. Mm -hmm. And also the time frame that you do the poll in, polls on Guam are generally only good for three days. You can't leave a poll open for four weeks and come up with valid results. Mm -hmm. It has to be kind of like in a little window. So, so, so basically you're, you're saying <clears throat> if you conduct a poll, you release a poll on Friday that you, maybe you did on Wednesday. Now, if a person is at number one and maybe are number two and may have done, say, done something over the weekend come Monday, that may, I mean, that will change like almost right away, right? By Friday, when you announce a poll, the results can change over the weekend, in particular over the weekend because people and their families talk and, mm -hmm. and they mix and, mm -hmm. and match their opinions. Another thing is just because a person does well in a poll, people may see that. And it, even if it's a poll that's done scientifically, sure. they may see that and say, oh, they don't need my vote. And so that reduces the person's mm -hmm. uh, number of votes that they get, you know, and, and they fall fairly precipitously. But in general, a good solid poll is specific, it fits, it's relative, it's current to the time frame. Uh, the person doing the poll has the right kind of background to mm -hmm. do polling. And over at the university, the little uh, place I work at over there, there are plenty of people that could do very legitimate mm -hmm. polls on any number mm -hmm. of community topics, and you can get really good information. Mm -hmm. Now, let, let me talk about that, because you said polls can change almost right away. Mm -hmm. I mean, one of the examples is, is um, um, as soon as the uh, as soon as um, Liz Barrett Anderson announced her candidacy, sure. I guess, to run, her numbers went pew, sure. real high, okay? And I mean, that, that was just real high. A few days later, right. you come out and you said, man, that, it that it came out, it, it was like, it was, sure. it, it was equal. What happens there? What happens is a uh, novel new candidate, new female candidate versus an in-place kind of candidate, mm -hmm. uh, you get out fast start, and then what happens is people talk about it and they kind of sort of even out. And there's a, a mantra to live by on Guam, and that is everybody has a voodoo doll out for somebody in this town. <laughs> and so there are people who don't like... Uh, I know, I don't want I mean, there's some people who do not like Judge Anderson. And so, of course, they're going to try to influence people not to vote for her. Yeah. On the other hand, uh, people over time they balance out and so people say oh well the attorney general's pretty much kind of sort of done a mm -hmm. good job and those tend to balance out and that's what happened I think in that case. In, in that case. And it's about even right now. I mean they go up and down but they're pretty close and they've yeah. been close and that's gonna be a, an interesting race to watch. There we go. And actually um, I think um, maybe by by week's end you'll probably have some results of some polls right? Yeah we'll have some. We're gonna pay some bills right now. <laughs> I got a poll to attend to. Be right back.